hello what's up guys so in this video i'm going to show you how you can create changing logos on scroll and sticky header using elementor and elementor pro now you will require elementor pro for this tutorial if you already have an elementor pro that is great but if, if you don't have elementor pro i'll drop a link in description so that you can get your own license for elementor pro so without wasting time if you are interested let's get started first thing that you need to do is to go to dashboard and once you are on the dashboard go to the templates and click on all and click on add new and from here select header and name it as changing logos on scroll and click on create template once the elementor page builder will load it click on this plus icon and choose this layout and from here i want the first column to be of 25 percent of width and the next one to be of 75 percent width in the first column i'll dra drop two image widgets one for the dark and one for the light version of logo so i'll quickly select the logos and here is the light version i'll align them towards the left and in the column settings i want the widget spacing to be of zero so i don't want any widget spacing in here and then the next thing i want to drop my navigation menu i already have stylized the navigations in the current header that i have on the website so i'll simply copy those navigation menu widget and paste it here just like this i'll click on copy and i'll paste it here now we have navigation set it up I want to align it towards the right and the column setting I want it vertically aligned to the middle just like this now because this is going to be a transparent header so I want the background type to be of transparent but just to make the things visible for us I would like to have some background so there will be an image behind this transparent header so for that i want the text color to be black or to be white sorry and then what you need to do is to add some css now you do not need to understand the css code i'll provide you a snippet and you can simply paste that code into your section so what you need to do is to click on section and go to advanced and go to custom css and then i'll provide you this css code copy this css code and paste this code here then the next thing that you need to do is to assign the css classes to your logos in the navigation menu widget so for the dark logo the css class is d logo i'll drop it below the white version and i'll name it as d logo now you can see it got disappeared from here that is fine and then for the light version of logo we have a css class you guessed it right that is l logo then the third thing we need to assign a css class to our navigation menu that will be sticky menu items so I'll copy this class and I'll simply paste this class here. Once that is done, the next thing that you need to do is to click on this edit section and then go to motion effects and from here choose sticky sticky on the top. And then from effects offset choose 100 pixels. So now you can see 
we have this white version of logo and white text and when we scroll down we have a change in color and text and change in the logo i'll vertically align them in the middle as well so once that is done click on publish click on add condition and choose entire site now you can see i already have a template created with elementor so i'll choose save and close and i'll have to go back to the dashboard in the dashboard i'll go to theme builder and from here you can see i already have one logo version here and the new logo that the header we have created is here so i'll click on this and from here i'll click on edit conditions and i do not want any condition here i'll click save and close and for this changing logos on scroll header i'll click edit condition and here you will have to make sure you have entire sites click on save and close and now if we check our website from the front end now you can see we have the header created but the thing is our header is not transparent so we need to make it transparent so i'll click on edit with elementor and the header will start loading i'll click on edit section style and i'll make the color transparent and then i'll go to advanced tab add a z index of say 5 and i'll add a negative margin probably minus 4 will work so if i refresh the website now so now you can see we have our low our header and now when we scroll down our header is changing the logos and bringing in the background so this is how you can create a changing header logo using elementor and elementor pro if, if you like this video please consider subscribing to my youtube channel and click on bell icon to get notified whenever i'll add a new video on my youtube channel and share this video i'll see you in the next video thank you very much